<laughs> oh my god, you, you serious for this your dress? Mm, I swear, guy, you guys just changed completely. What's <laughs> up now? What's it? You wear correct bed. <laughs> ah, see your fantasy babe, they come. Hi, guys. Hi. Um, can I talk to you? Sure. Um, I just wanted to apologize about yesterday. I really didn't mean to. No, 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 no. Don't try to pretend. You did mean it. And it's obvious that you come from a different world than ours, and you see the world through different lenses. You don't know us, and so that's your bias. I'm sorry. I don't know why you're here, but you are. And it's only fair that you do not judge us, you do not look down on us. You're right. I, I f***ed up and I will be better, I will do better. I'm trying to do better. In fact, I'm going to do better. I promise. Where can you go? I will try to believe you. Fine, I'll, I'll take that. Thank you. See you around. I just did drink. <laughs> Not today. They drink. <laughs> don't worry, guys. They're okay. Don't worry. Don't worry. Did it make sense, Sha? I swear, I swear. I'm going to figure out that one. Forest can be defined as a large land covered with trees and bushes. Then forestry or forest management is the management of forests and forest resources. Understood? Yes, sir. How then do you manage forests and forest resources? Anyone? Um, you at the back, the new girl. Prohibition of bush burning. My friend, stand up if you want to ask a question. Prohibition of bush burning, ban on indiscriminate cutting of timber trees, encouraging people to plant more trees, ban on collecting of leaves and firewood from forests, ban on farming on forest reserves, and ban on indiscriminate cutting of underage trees. That is very good. You see, in Africa, we are accustomed to the use of firewood to cook. And that is why any small thing you and your mother rush down to the bush to cut down a healthy tree. <laughs> Sir, do you use gas to cook in your house? Uh, I am so sorry, sir. I didn't know my phone was non-silence. Forgive me. Hand it over. What? Obey before complain. Are you all not aware that coming to school with a cell phone is prohibited? What? My phone is a necessity. I need it for emergencies. Just look at the phone a young girl like you is bringing to school. Please, what, what is it called? A stolen phone, sir. Sir, it's an iPhone. This must have cost a lot of money. Oh yeah, money, sir. This is why phones are banned in school. Because it's a distraction. If any other person have your phone in their bags, bring it out now. If I conduct a search, it's going to be worse. Terrible for you. So if you have a phone, bring it out now. And don't even bother making any sudden movements. Bring it, you might just be spared. Uh, Master Callistus. Sir. Please, can you help me do something? All right, sir. Oh, 
All of you, step aside from your lockers. And before you do that, drop your bags on, on your table. Now! Please, help me sign your bags. All right! Step aside, move to the front of the class, now! Let's go, let's go, let's go! Move it, move it, move it! That's it, sir. Okay. Yeah. Be warned. No phones to school. People will not hear word. If you enter my trap, <laughs> it's gonna be over for you. All right. Thank you very much. Of course, sir. I, I, I will deal with all of you. You all report to school tomorrow with the guardian. If you want your phones back. Understood? Understood? Yes, sir. Good. New girl. I heard you got into trouble today. Yes. I gave my classmates more reasons to dislike me. I'm sure they'll get over it. Hopefully. Are you stalking me? Hmm? What? No, no. It's just, just a coincidence. Relax. I'm just teasing you. <laughs> Very funny. So, care to share why you're here? Seeing as I'm your, your only friend. You're so sleek. I mean, am I not your only friend? Fine. So, this is actually a punishment for my dad. He's trying to teach me some type of lesson. Wow. So, we are your punishments? <laughs> well, that's what he thinks. So are you, are you learning your lesson? Uh, in all honesty, I think I am. Do you care to share? Well, I got suspended for bullying. And with everything I've been facing since I got here, now I realize how he feels and I know it's bad and I shouldn't be doing it. You're standing up for yourself quite all right. I guess. I don't I She didn't really see me. And look. What is TK doing with that witch? Maybe they like each other. Like what? Are you okay? What do you mean by that? It's because she's fair. 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 Are you not fair? See, I think this boy is blind. This boy seems blind. See me? It's time to show him and tell him how you feel about him. Yes. Eh? Yes. Am I no I bet. What do you mean? If the boy is supposed to tell again how she feels not the other way, I'm not going to do it. See me? See. This is the 21st century. A girl has every right to tell the guy how she feels. Okay. 
Yes, honestly, you can't. What if somebody else going to tell the boy now and he now falls for the girl? Mm. Will you like it? Mm. Yeah, yeah, see, we're in that right, we're in that passage where this is our right at the Gen Z. Do you get? You have to tell TK that you like him. Come on. But even though I don't, I don't know what to write. You don't know what to write. Text him now. I don't have a phone. Oh. See me. Write TK a letter. Oh my God. God. See, see me, you have to write him a letter. Writing letters are so cute, I swear. And then you put this kiss and you, you rub this um, red lipstick on your lips and then you put the kiss sign on it. And kiss it. Yes! And then you spray perfume after everything. It doesn't fall for you. Let me know what causes it. You see? I write him a letter. Tick is going to like me. Of course. <laughs> of course, you will like But What if he doesn't like me? Uh-uh. What do you mean by that? Have you seen you? Girl, you are beautiful. You're not just seeing me for nothing. Are you, are you playing? Don't mind him. He likes you. He just doesn't know it yet. And without you get here now, it's going to be doing like this. So do it and come on, take it to guy now. <sighs> Finally. Because I'm really seeing the future. Finally. You better be fast I'm about trying. it. <laughs> <It's good. laughs> Like, this is so absurd. Phones are for emergency. Kiddo, there are rules for a reason. Not letting your phone ring during classes is a reasonable reason. But not bringing your phone to school at all, that's very unreasonable. The school has a point, as do you. <sighs> Mom, what if something happened to me and I needed to call you or dad? Think about it. Just obey the rules, kiddo. You're adapting, remember? <sighs> the rules are stupid. All right. I'll go with you tomorrow. Okay, thank you, Mom. Oh, my sweet phone. My darling phone. I need my phone back. I can't believe I have to stay without my phone. Like, phones are an important part of our lives. I'm sure you'll see your phone again tomorrow. Okay, thank you, Mom. Teenage um, phone addiction has become a thing of pandemic. Oh. It's a leading cause of uh, depression, bullying, low self-esteem, and even lack of confidence. So you see, when we are advising these children and we are taking all these measures, it's just simply because we are trying to save lives. I understand you, Mr. Lamidi. Yes. And um, isn't Amanda too young to be using such an expensive phone? Uh, I mean, uh, it's too much. We apologize for that. And um, be rest assured it will never happen again. Oh, no problem. Um, here's the phone. Oh, thank mm. you. And um, if there is any other incident or any emergency at mm. all, just be rest assured that you will be the first I'll call. Oh, thank you so much. You're welcome. All right. welcome. Have a nice day. You too. My regards to your husband. He will hear. Yes. And you, what are you doing here? Are you not supposed to be in class? Or oh, you have be fast? Is she really your mom? Yes. Oh, my she fine. Die! <laughs> Jesus. She's supposed to be on the cover of a magazine. Aww. I definitely concur. She's not too young to be on. 
Maybe they burn out for us. You must be really stupid. They mad. What did you say to me? You heard me right. See me put a leash on your dog. Plus, you want me the dog bite you. Thank you. Huh? Yes. Sit down, sit down, sit down. Um, if you know what's good for you, bring out your book and start reading. Ah, you come, come, come. Hi. <coughs> Go and buy me um, beans and bread eh, in the school canteen. Oh. Sir, but I need to read my test book. What? My test book. I don't understand. What are you studying for? You that used to carry press up and down. You are a bookworm already now, so what are you reading for? You want to run mad? Sir, as a matter of fact, this is very wrong. You are a teacher in school between all of us. Really? Ah, ah. So you want me to uh, spoon feed you? Hmm? So you are deaf. You know here when I say you should, you should bring out your book. Is that not part of teaching? Then what are we supposed to read if you haven't taught us anything? Wow. Nice one. Okay, um, eh, go, go back to your seat, eh? <laughs> okay, <clears throat> I'm going to make it easy for you people, eh? <laughs> so, uh, sharp your brain up, because we are writing test now. <laughs> hey, 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 I don't say. I don't, I don't want to hear noise, though. So you want to, you want to tell me how to, how to do my work now, Abi? Sas, 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 I'm not prepared. Uh, fail now. Where's the, this thing? Come and clean this board. Stand up. Come and clean this board. Hi, TK. I hope you're good. I need to tell you something, and that's why I'm writing this letter. Oh, God, it's not working. Hi, TK. Oh. Hey, girl. How's the later writing going? Okay, I don't know what to write. How are you the smartest one? Is it by that one? Okay. Like, I don't even have the right words. What do you mean by you don't have the right words? Okay, calm down. How does it make you feel? I don't know, I just like him. Why do you like him? Because he's so handsome. Okay, keep going. And he's so smart. Mm -hmm. I mean, even though he doesn't like to come to school. But... Oh, he's changing already. He might not be of the best behavior, but he has a very good heart. You see, you can do this. See, all you have to do is just put your feelings into writing. Give him reasons why you like him. Come on, you can do this. She loved doctor. <laughs> I know, right? Come on, let's go. Okay. <clears throat> Good girl. Let's go, let's go. How are you? You, you're not talk talking, Abby. Master Kali. Master Kali. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Um, sir, my, my phone, sir. I don't understand. Sir, my phone uh, from yesterday, sir. Is... So let me tell you, a contraband is no more your property. You understand? Now go back to your class. Sir, 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 sir. Please, now, I just, I just want to make a negotiation. Uh, <laughs> nice, man. Uh, now you are talking now. <clears throat> How much do you have there? Sir. So it's just 250, sir. Don't look like you're mate. Sir, sir, okay, I'll, I'll make it 300. 
hundred. If I sell that phone in Banex, do you know how much I want? It's my lunch money. I don't have anything. Make it one thousand. One thousand. Shut your mouth. Yes, so I have this book for you. I read it in first time. Okay. So you should go through it before I come around later. Okay. So when you're done reading, I would come later to see you. Okay. Yeah, read from the first page. All right. So I'll see you later. Oh, guys, I have to enter house now. I have chores to do. <laughs> now, since when you started, you do chores? That's very good. Since I grew up, I'm keeping mad. I'm like, when I always see the sock on my breast. You did mad. You did mad, guys. Oh, yes, I always do it. I'm coming. I'm mad. Of belief, I just cry. 